Hey guys, what's going on? So today we're gonna to be talking about my custom one piece keyboard. And I have to say, this is one of the best purchases I have made for 2021 because I needed a keyboard. I was using a keyboard that had broken switches for the longest time. So I did decide to pick up this when I did see it was limited and they were doing a one piece clap. You obviously know this is an anime channel, so I am a one piece fan. And when I saw this One Piece keyboard, I just know I had to grab it, especially because we're in the Wano arc right now, and it just seemed so fitting. So this is my custom One Piece keyboard. So we're gonna be talking about this, going over it a little bit, and it's gonna be a review. So this keyboard is from a company called Akko, and it's, I think I'm pronouncing that right, it's A-K-K-O. And they did do a licensed collab with Toei Animation to bring us this One Piece Wano themed keyboard, which I will show you more of the details and stuff like that later on. So first starting off, this is a One Piece Wano themed keyboard. As you can tell by the color scheme, and it is 100% wireless. You could switch it to Mac mode, USB mode, or Windows mode. So it is USB type C and it does allow you to use the Bluetooth or use it wired however you want. And one thing that I was also tempted on picking up when I did buy this keyboard is they do have custom wrist rests and Wano themed mouse pads. So if you are interested in picking up this keyboard, you can also check those out. So we'll get into all the special features and lighting and everything like that later on. But the first thing that really jumped out of me with this keyboard was it just the customization of it when it comes down to the custom keycaps, how they have each one of the straw hats on them and how the space bar, it's textured different and it has the Wano themed pattern on it. So everything about this keyboard aesthetically is exactly what I was looking for in purchasing this keyboard, especially because it's one piece. So the keyboard definitely is everything I was expecting aesthetically wise, especially like the matte texture feels. And one thing we'll go into later is these keys. So I'll show you each of the Straw Hat keys. So you can see each of the keys are One Piece themed and the keyboard font is actually the One Piece font. And they also do have the keys. I don't know if you can see it there. They also do have the keys are in both English and in Japanese. So going through more customization features of the keyboard, an aesthetically pleasing feature, you do get these custom one piece character themed keycaps. So you get nine keycaps and they're all the straw hats. So this one right here is Luffy and we also have Zoro right here. So you do get to customize your keyboard with all these keycaps. So we have Robin, Chopper, Brooke, Sanji, Frankie, Usopp, Nami, Luffy, and Zoro. We have all those. Unfortunately, we don't have Jinbei even though he is in the Wano arc. And some other accessories that do come in the box is the key picker and this cable, which also matches the theme by being pink. So getting into the specs of the keyboard, the keyboard does have pink jelly tactile switches, which the switches are lubed and it does have a foam back plate. So the keyboard does sound amazing, especially with the loop switches like on the space bar and other keys like function keys like enter and shift. Switch. And in my opinion, the keyboard does sound pretty nice. It doesn't sound cheap or fake. You can really hear the foam dampening the sound of the keys and how soft the keys are to press, especially that space bar with the switches being lubed and everything. So I really like that and I really do like these switches, especially because the switches do match the theme of the keyboard and they're pink. And you do not get a cheap sound at all. I wish I had another keyboard to show you what a cheap keyboard sounds like. Wait, actually I do. I can get someone to show you a really cheap sounding keyboard. I got you, this one won't sound like. And that right there is what a really bad, horrible, cheap keyboard sounds like. So this one sounds a whole lot better than that, as you can hear. So when it comes to comfortability, you do have the kickstand on the keyboard, which tilts it up, which is actually pretty nice because sometimes I like to have my keyboard a little elevated, which it makes it feel a lot better. So I popped off one of the keys and as you could see, the switch is pink and it does have a white back plate and it is full RGB and customizable. So you can download their app and fully customize your keyboard. Right now, I tend to keep it pink, but there is hundreds of pre-built in color options that you can use, or you can go on the app and customize it key by key or any multiple ways that you want. I I think they have the same functions and colors and patterns as Razer and Corsair. So you do get the fade, the rainbow, the tap explode. So you do have full customization when it comes to the lights on this keyboard. And one thing I did forget to mention, this keyboard is 100% hot swappable. So you can fully customize this keyboard to your heart's extent. So I have been using this keyboard for about two to three weeks now and 
I'm still pleasantly surprised by. It does have a good feel. It does have a good feel. It is compact. It's not a full size keyboard. They do have a full size keyboard on the website, but I think it's sold out by now because I think there was only 50 of these keyboards and I do think they still have extra. I don't know if they even restock these keyboards. The keyboard was $120, but for everything that you're getting, the RGB lights, hot swappable, the phone, the lube switches, the custom one piece keyboard, I do think it is worth it. And they do have other keyboards on their website, such as Itachi, and Naruto, and Goku. So they do do anime branded keyboards or they have sections to build your own DIY keyboard. But overall, do I think it's a good purchase? Yes. Would I purchase from this site again? Yes. Am I pleasantly surprised? Yes. If you do want to check out this keyboard, all the links will be in the description. Unfortunately, I'm not sponsored, so I don't have a sponsor code. Hopefully, hopefully you see this video and I'll go if you see it, sponsor me. But that's all I have for you guys today. Let me know what you think of this keyboard review. It's something different. It still is anime themed because it is a one piece keyboard. But if you guys want to see more videos like this, just let me know. And if this video, let's say, gets up to 200 likes, I will buy the Itachi keyboard and do a review of that one. With all that being said, I want you guys to have a good day or night wherever you are in the world and peace.